Hey Taurus. <clears throat> hey Taurus, welcome back to the channel. It is Ashley here at Fire Intuition. I am here to do your collective reading. This is going to be for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, also Venus, or whatever you guys have Taurus in your chart. Do keep in mind that this is general and that it may or may not resonate with all of you Taurus out there. But if it does, show your girls some love. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell. Alrighty. So let's hop in, loves. Let's see what's going on with you, Taurus. We're gonna pull some spirit messages and then we'll hop into the little portion of your reading. Alright, let's see what's going on. Taurus, let's see. So we have take a step back. And it says, thank you, angels, for helping me to step back from what's not serving me. Okay, so Taurus, your angels are proud of you for, you know, stepping back from what no longer serves you. You know, it's not for your best and highest good. We have devotion. What is it? Chris. Krishna. Krishna. It says, trust your spiritual guidance. Your commitment has been recognized. You are loved unconditionally. All right. So because of your hard work and dedication, you will be rewarded. So spirit is watching you at this time. The universe is watching you at this time, Taurus. All right. So I wanted three, but we'll just take these because they both came out. So we have shine your lights. And it says, Archangel, you real. Thank you, Urel, for helping me to share my light with the world. All right, so it's time for you guys to share your light with the world if you guys haven't already. Some of you guys are healers, light workers. We have trust your vibes. Thank you, angels. Today I choose to trust my intuition and your guidance. All right, so you are trusting your intuition and the guidance from your spirit guide, spirit, the universe, source, whoever you guys believe in. All right, so let's hop into the love portion of your reading. Taurus, and let's see what's going on with you guys. Let's see, messages from Taurus. We're going to look at your person's feelings and their intentions. So let's see, some rising, also Venus. Messages for Taurus. <clears throat> Excuse my voice, Taurus. It keeps, you already know it keeps going in and out. So let's see, Taurus. Let's look at your person's feelings. Taurus, your person's feelings. With a five of wands, seven of swords. We have the ten of swords in reverse. So what's going on, Taurus? Seems like there's a lot of drama. Some secrets, some lies, some deception, something's going on. And it could be with somebody in your neighborhood, your community, or somebody near you. There's houses in the background. Somebody's seen something. There could be an, an old neighbor or a friend or somebody has seen your person or seen something. Some of you guys were born in 75. So let's see. Looks like your person does want to start over. But there's just a lot of people in your relationship, in your business. Because we have males and females here. And um, on this side of lines. So that means that there's different people. Unless you guys are like open or, you know, into like that type of relationship. We all bring people into our relationship to their own, you know, males and females. But um, let me see if I want to see. So that's what's keeping this relationship stagnant, stuck, judgment. So, okay, I see what it is. They're listening to everybody but you. And these people are jealous of you. That's why. So they're listening to everybody but you. But the people that they're, the people they're listening to are jealous and don't like you. They need to think for themselves. Could be a Virgo, a Gemini, 
another Taurus, a Libra. Let's see why this Seven of Swords is here. They're trying to convince you something isn't what it is. And that they... So they're trying to convince you that something is what it's... Okay, so... Let me see something. They Somebody is lying on them, they feel like. Let me see, but did they do it? No. They were seen around this person or at this person's house. But what they said happened did not happen. Mm -mm. No, so this is kind of weird though because this person wants to be with you but they feel like you don't believe them. And then it's like the, person, the people that they listen to are jealous of you and don't like you and they tend to believe them. But nothing happened though. Someone's lying on them to stop you guys from getting back together. Yeah, that's what this is about. Because I don't see where anything happened. You know, I will tell you real quick. Somebody doesn't want y'all to start over. Why is it Ten of Swords in reverse? Could be a Leo. Or an ex or somebody that they're with now. Mm -hmm. Something is not adding up though. I feel like if you really sit down and think about it to where it's like the date and the time or something is not adding up, something that they said. Y'all are gonna be together anyway, but yeah, somebody is um somebody is lying on your person to make you mad and to stop y'all from you know getting back together. That's what I'm getting. Or they could be lying on you to your person. It's either or. So they're lying on you or your person. Somebody is lying though. Somebody did see you or see them do something, but it wasn't like that though. It wasn't like what they are trying to make it sound like or seem. It's something like that. Something really weird like that. So let's pull some love messages and see. Messages for Taurus, love messages. So we have mirror reflecting, share feelings, you. So let's see something. So you and your person could be mirroring each other. We have limit, final straw, overload, breaking point. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, like clashing. See, somebody is trying to make you guys clash or bring you to a breaking point or like they're trying to like really, really piss you off and make you upset. Yeah, see, they're trying to stop and block your happiness. See, nourished because they know this person wants to get back with you or they know that if y'all get back together you know like that they don't they won't have a chance anymore or it could just be like it can be a jealous friend, family member or somebody that just doesn't want to see y'all together it could be something like that you know apprehensive guarded cautious afraid so you may be kind of afraid to move forward you are your person and kind of running away from the situation but in time somebody will get the truth like time will tell like yeah, concealing. See, any type of secrets or something that was hidden, something will be revealed mm -hmm, to you or about you, but in a good way. Mm -hmm. I do see the commitment here. So I feel like whatever is going on, it will be revealed, though, Taurus. But the fact that they're lying to you about your person or lying to your person about you is, like, very trifling and says a lot for that person. Because is it that serious? Just saying. Let's see what your person's intentions are. See, and you're, it's making your person want to give up. It's making your person feel torn. Yep, could be a Leo. But it's making your person feel torn. 
Your person doesn't know what to do. Your person is frustrated and annoyed and losing it. They don't know who to trust, what to do. Why is this train card reverse? Page of Wands. I do see good news coming in. Let me see. No, what this is, is you're going to hear from an ex. This may be the person that's starting the shit. Mm -hmm. So let me see something. Let me see where this is going. Oh, I see where this is going. So whoever this, okay. So whoever lied on your person is going to like reach out to your person. It has to be an ex or somebody that wants them. And they're going to be like, oh, you can come stay with me. You can come be over here with me. You know, I know she put you out or he put you out. Like, you can come stay over here with me. You know, I want to be like, they're going to say something like that. And I feel like what it's going to do is going to like ring a bell to your person. Like, what's going on? It may not right away. But I feel like your person is going to like put two and two together. Let's see. Yeah, because see, whoever this is, they know in the back of their mind that this person always wanted them or wants them still, right? Could be an Aquarius Seed or a Gemini, but your person is going to put two and two together. Taurus. Let's see how the two of swords is here. Yep, see, this is a person that got them torn in their head about you. Lying, this is the person that's lying on you. Whoever they're like going to, they're going to someone's house or they're going with someone or someone is telling them that they can come towards them or come over there or stay with them or something like that. See, look, the devil came out on the four of wands reverse. After they all break up, could be a Capricorn. See, two of wands. See, nine of cups. Look, they're into your person. They're infatuated. They're obsessed. They really want to be with them. See that? And they, they couldn't wait for this to happen. Mm-hmm. Yep. So I feel like this was kind of like planned out. I feel like whatever they did towards there, they did it on purpose to like, you know, get your person to give in. Somebody's real trifling here. And I don't know what made them believe them over you. Or like I said, this could be the other way around, but I definitely probably feel like this is what's going on with your person. Because they lied to you about them or said something. I know this is scattered, but like they said something to them. I mean to you about them. You know, so that's why I said what they said about your person was a lie. And they knew it was going to make you mad. And they knew you were already mad for some of you guys. And that you were probably going to like put them out or break up with them. So that was just a part of their plan. There could have been some like messages coming in or some stuff coming in. Block numbers, calls, DMs, something like that. I feel like somebody had this plan and strategize, like strategize this out, plan this out. Let's see. Messages for Taurus. We have marriage. This connection is leading towards sharing the same last name. So y'all could have been engaged too. You know, planning a wedding. See, look, a third party is trying to come in between a marriage or like a, an engagement or y'all being together. Who will rush in? See, keep the relationship sacred. People will have something to say. Keep this relationship sacred. So I told you. We have quality time. As you spend more time with your partner, you will experience more intimacy. So maybe you guys haven't been as intimate lately. But it looks like if you guys were to reconnect, you guys will be. We have butterflies. So your person is still getting butterflies over you. We have distant love, though. But there's distance here. Someone is always thinking of you. So your person is still thinking of you, even though y'all are together. We have self-sabotage. Be cautious of the words and stories you tell yourself. So... I don't know, um, Taurus, I feel like this is for both of y'all to kind of like reflect on. I feel like not saying like, you know, this ex ex unfolded exactly like this. But for some of you guys, you believe something that somebody told you or you went off something that you saw or somebody said. Okay. And then they're believing this person or whatever. So they got both of y'all. Well, they're playing both of y'all. Okay. So let's see what's going on with your love blockages. Let's see where Taurus is blocked that in love. Where's Taurus blocked that in love? All right, so we have two passive. 
Okay, take the initiative to meet someone and keep fashion united. So sometimes you can just be too passive. We have mixed signals. And it says, you don't let others know you are interested. Third, and be approachable. So sometimes you could be like kind of like unapproachable or, you know, push people away. Or you give people mixed signals. These are your little blockages. All right. Let's see. Y'all have four. A one and three. But we have insecurities. Work on building your confidence and feeling safe in your relationships. So there could be some insecurities here, Taurus. And then we have fear of loss. You are afraid of losing someone or of being abandoned or alone. Take a chance. So you fear the loss of someone or you fear the loss when it comes to love or having love or having people around you. You don't know how to take losses, like, or move on. You don't like rejection, stuff like that. Alrighty, so let's pull your spirit message. And that will be a reading to us. So, Taurus, we got break addiction, number five. Let go of your addictions. So it says, all habits are an attempt to suppress uneasy, undesired feelings by using outside means to alter one's mood. On the deepest levels, your, neg your negative habits are trying to direct you towards a search for, for the spirit. A negative habit first occurs in the astral body when your I am are the part of you that has the strength to guide the body. Weakness. The longer you entertain the negative habit, the stronger it becomes. It then enters your, your body where it becomes an addiction. Whatever your addiction is, whether it is gambling, food, alcohol, success, coffee, drugs, worry, drama, criticism, seeing something wrong with your body, spending more money than you have, stressing or focusing on the lack thereof, it's time to go within and gain back. Recognize that you are stronger than this addiction and have the power to overcome it. You can rebuild your inner strength and self-belief, okay? So, y'all are needed to overcome some type of addiction, break some type of addiction. Remember, it says the addiction could be gambling, food, alcohol, success, coffee, drugs, even energy drinks, worry, drama, criticism, seeing something wrong in your body, spending more time than you have, um, spending more money than you have, stressing or focusing on the lack thereof, okay? Alrighty, Taurus, so that is your reading. If it resonated, please do like, share, comment, subscribe, hit that bell. And if you guys would love to book with me, you already know, fireintuition.com. Bye, Taurus.